The event is a business-to-business -business event, green business event, as Old Park Meadow is a natural burial ground and into nature and the environment and everything, the, uh, it works really well here. Uh, people heard how, that it was a good event last year and new people want to come and attend and have stalls and stands and also other delegates want to come along and it's really friendly, it's a buzzing atmosphere, uh, lots of chatter about what people can do in the future and how they can make their businesses a bit greener. Essex Wildlife Trust has been hosting the Green Expo exhibition and we're delighted to be talking to all of these businesses. I've been absolutely blown away by the energy, the passion, the knowledge around sustainability and all things green with these businesses and and uh, it's incredible to have these businesses, they're such a key part of the work that we do. It's really fundamental that the businesses are supporting us in what we do. We can't do it on our own and those businesses are doing fantastic things and I think it's very, very inspiring for me to see all of these incredible conversations that have been going on. We're the headline sponsors of the event, so it's great to be here. It's really bustling, they've done an amazing job at getting loads of delegates here. We're meeting really cool businesses who are interested in the services that we're showcasing today. There's been people here from nine o'clock and it's still really busy now, so absolutely fantastic effort by the, by the team here, getting so many people here. That we're an Essex-based business, we care about the community. It coincides nicely with the services and solutions that we have on offer from a sustainability perspective. And we want to get more involved in the sort of projects that they're offering throughout their reserves across Essex. We're very much into sustainability, Looking at today's attendance and what's happened, uh, I found it really interesting and it's a very well prepared uh, event. I, I think it's essential, I think more for our health, but also we need to look at sustainability in the world. But also, in theory, as the evolution happens, things should become cheaper. Of the, other, the uh, advanced hydrogen technologies, we're looking at ways of creating electricity and heating through hydrogen, and we're hoping that that will help reduce people's costs of living. We've got essentially um the, the, the world's only uh, low energy LED lighting tower, which is powered off of hydrogen. That's as noisy as it gets. So, well, I think everybody uh, these days in, in today's climate is doing their best for sustainability. And it's ideal to turn up at places like this to make people more aware of what's available on the market. I think it's very important for people to remember that sustainability is more than just about the environment. Um, it's about considering people as well. We always use the phrase that doing good is good for business. So it's about getting that message across that if you do the right things, actually guess what, you'll also be more profitable. We need to keep that balance of nature. And of course, yes, it's Wildlife Trust plays a huge role in doing that, in ensuring that we have these beautiful nature reserves and, and you know, at the creatures that are part of our ecosystem, that have got every right as much to be on this planet as we have. The main takeaway, I think, is that we want people to feel that they're part of the solution. It's not just about Essex Wildlife Trust managing wildlife or managing the environment. It's not just our job. We can be a catalyst, we can be a leader, we can be a role model, but actually we all play a part and we want effectively one in four people in Essex taking action for wildlife and stepping up and businesses can play a huge part in that. So if people go away feeling that they're part of the solution, they're excited to be part of that journey, then that's a wonderful message to take away.